lucky we are to have such great weather. Yeah, he looks great. And welcome to the <laughs> Century yeah. Club. I hope I look that good when I'm, you know. I want a secret. 80? Yeah. <laughs> so I was gonna, we'll see how things go. Let's <laughs> take a look weather-wise. Many more fire seasons like we had, and I'm going to look like that next year. Fog and clouds in place as we head through the rest of tonight. The fog is beginning to move in. We're going to see some clouds later tonight with a cold front moving in, but not much of a chance of anything more than a sprinkle for the North Bay. We'll look at it on Futurecast in just a second. Part of the cloudy skies tomorrow. The sun will reemerge. It'll be cooler and rather breezy, especially during the afternoon and early evening. Still breezy on Thanksgiving. Otherwise, a nice day for Turkey Day. Just make sure you have the outdoor tablecloth weighed down so it doesn't blow away the Thanksgiving feast, mild days, and chilly nights all the way through Thanksgiving weekend. Let's talk about that chance of sprinkles for the North Bay tonight. We're starting off with just clouds on Futurecast. There's that cold front just falling apart as it tries to move towards the North Bay. Mendocino and Lake Counties, you have a better chance of seeing at least a passing shower, but even there, you're talking about a trace of rain around Ukiah. Nothing expected across the rest of the Bay Area other than some passing clouds and some of that fog to start the day tomorrow, but that should dissipate quickly and we'll see a lot of sunshine really the rest of the day and it looks like clear skies tomorrow night into Thanksgiving morning and plenty of sunshine in store on Thanksgiving future cast agreeably blank for Thursday morning so not even expecting much in the way of fog but probably some chilly temperatures to start the day and then we will warm up nicely. We'll have an hour by hour look at Thanksgiving Day coming up at six o'clock. Let's take a look outside and highs from today. Well, nice look at San Jose where the temperature topped out into the upper 60s. Mild temperatures for this time of year, 68 degrees there, 70 on the nose in Concord, otherwise mostly mid 60s, Santa Rosa, San Francisco and Fremont, but only mid 50s, Half Moon Bay, a little bit cooler along the coast. Temperatures right now, Still mostly in the 50s with a couple spots clinging to the low 60s. 61 in Fairfield and San Jose, 63 in Concord is the warm location, 52 in Petaluma and Half Moon Bay. Those are the cool spots. We'll drop off tonight, but maybe a couple degrees warmer than where we started off this morning, around 50 in San Francisco, but that's going to be the warm spot, mostly 40s farther inland with a couple spots in the North Bay dipping down into the upper 30s. And then we'll warm up nicely back up into the low 60s in San Francisco by early tomorrow afternoon. But temperatures will drop off. And again, once we get rid of that early morning fog, it's plenty of sunshine for the rest of the day. San Jose warms up to around 60 degrees. One of the rare days where San Jose might be a degree or two cooler than San Francisco, but it's going to be very, very close. Not even much of a noticeable difference. Temperatures into the low 60s for Santa Rosa. Those winds starting to pick up during the afternoon. Sustained winds 10 to 15 miles an hour, but the gusts are going to be in that 20 to 30 miles an hour range so keep it in mind as you're driving around especially if you drive something that's a little higher profile the wind's going to try to move you around on the road just a little bit temperatures into the low 60s for concord after topping out near 70 today so we're trading quite a bit for high temperatures tomorrow but this is where we're supposed to be this year for this time of year upper 50s along the coast otherwise pretty much low 60s across the board with the warmest spots farther inland reaching up into the mid 60s we'll warm up a couple degrees for thanksgiving day it will still be breezy keep that in mind mid 60s persist though for inland parts of the Bay Area Friday, Saturday, and Sunday with low 60s around the Bay and mid to upper 50s along the coast. No rain in the seven-day forecast, just a gradual increase in cloud cover early next week. We'll monitor that in case Mother Nature decides to bless us with a chance for a few passing showers by Monday and Tuesday. But the weekend will be dry. We'll have that hour-by-hour -hour Thanksgiving forecast coming up at 6. All right, Paul.